Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Luter FM, as always, and we are on episode 66 of the Rafe Rovers journey. Uh, where you left us off last, we are currently fifth. We've had one hell of a bad run. Um, we were like second and third, and now we're fifth. So it's not going well. It's not going to plan, so to speak. Uh, the last episode, I think we... We played three games and we literally only we won one, lost one, and drew one. So we really need to get back on track in the league now. Um, we're still in the Scottish Cup though, so that's one positive. And um, we've got St Mirren, and so uh, and that'll be the last game of the regular season, and then it'll go to the Champions playoff, which is what we need to be in. We need to get in that <clears throat> top five. So we need to win these games back to back really to stand any chance because we've got to hope that the other teams falter as well. We are playing Hibs. So hopefully if we beat Hibs, we go back and we replace them in that top four. Sorry, not top five, top four. Um, and we might even leapfrog other teams like Celtic and Hearts because we're only, I mean, you look at it, there's certainly three points behind fifth and second place. So anything can happen. Um, I just hope I can get into that top four league position but yeah um, we've had a few players a few youth players signing contracts for us uh, there we go so let's go through we've got David Fletcher 15 year old striker uh, decent finishing good natural fitness uh, decent leadership and off the ball <laughs> Good flair um, and balanced personality. So hopefully he'll do well. And then we've got Kevin Mackey. He's a midfielder, defensive midfielder, attacking midfield central. He can play as a, mostly as a deep lying playmaker, which is a position we do play in. Um, but I think he's just behind there. Yeah, he can play there as well. So he's got a good first touch. Um, sorry, decent first touch, good passing, good technique. Good flair, decent vision, decent balance, and obviously these will they will improve as time goes on as well, and balance personality as well. Um, I'll just quickly go through these. He's unambitious, so he probably won't work out. Low self belief, which is not what you want to hear, and he's at least fairly determined. So they're the most they're the probably the best ones that we've got. So. Um, we just go to where's training. There we go. We'll just do that. Hopefully, one or two of the young players can come into this eventually. <clears throat> but we'll see. Right. Just praise Bruce. Doing well. Uh, Rigo will be back in a sec. Oh, Bryn's out for a flipping long rest of the season, basically. Uh, Baxter's here, chilling on my leg. By the way, he, uh, my girlfriend, had to stay at hers yesterday because uh, she's got some work, getting some work done in the house. So uh, it was just me. It was just the boys last yesterday, and he had to go to the vets to have his second um, second vaccine yesterday, and he did not like that. I can understand that because nobody likes needles, but. Um, Poor little thing, I had to really hold him tight because he kept wriggling. I didn't want him to get hurt even more. So on top of that, he also fell off the sofa because he was trying to play silly buggers and he hit his chin as he come down and he and I heard him yelp. So he, he was in the wars yesterday, bless him. So I give him a bit more TLC than usual. Um, managed to give him a little walk on the harness that we've got. He uh, he, he wasn't happy. He He's not really one for walking yet. Um, I think it's more of a confidence issue more than laziness. He gets a, he gets a bit scared when he's walking. So, but he's all right. He was a bit annoying last night with me. He was a bit needy, but he was all right. Like I said, I, I managed to get some sleep. You know what it's like when you got a puppy first couple of weeks. Anyway, right, playing Hibs next. Must win game for us. So we've got Duras in goal. Oyana was right back. Franzis and. Diaz in centre defence, Bruce is left back, Bobson and Petrovic in centre midfield, Bowler on the right, Mar in the middle, Ali Salia on the left, and Hoyland up front. So let's see what we can do in this game. Hopefully, we win. 
if we lose, I think we're pretty much not going to be in the championship playoffs. The champions playoffs, whatever they called it. Sorry for making weird noises with my throat. I've uh, I sneezed a couple of times before I started. Now my throat's all clogged up, so I'm trying to constantly clear it. So I apologise. Uh, a uneventful first half. I'm about to take somebody off already. Oyana's had to come off. Diaz is going to have to come off. Right, we're in possession. Good. Diaz. Ali Salia. Bar, what a ball. Go on, Hoyland. Oh, Hoyland, come on. That was the one highlight of the game. Bob Senior coming off now. Moran can come on for you. Uh, I can't take any more players off, unfortunately. Oh, God, this is going to be a nil-nil, which means we're not going to leapfrog past Hibs. Come on. Come on. We've been the dominant team in this game. Oh, that's... Oh, no, don't be Hibs, for God's sake. Okay, come on, last minute winner. Come on, let's let's go. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, that was our chance. That was our chance. I'm really, really worried about us not getting to that Champions Playoff League now. We've got to hope that Hibs lose the next game and we beat Dundee United. <clears throat> Oh, Ayano's out for three weeks now. Uh, I'm just going to holiday. I'll still be on. I'm not going to go off. As always, thank you for everyone that's been subscribing so far. I know I say it every time, but you generally don't understand how much I appreciate it. And if you haven't, subscribe yet and you're just watching the videos if you don't mind could you just su subscribe um because it would help me get um up the youtube alg algorithm the more people that see me the more the better the videos will be because i'll be happy to put more into it because i know it's working you know what i mean i always try and do my best but it helps me at the end of the day so yeah much appreciated to the people who have done already and even if you're watching the videos and not subscribed Thank you as well. I do appreciate that as well. Um, but yeah, I'm hoping you're enjoying the Rafe Rovers save. <clears throat> right, nearly there. Uh, <clears throat> let's see how uh, is anybody actually doing well on that? oh there's a few Charlie Turner he's going to be a good prospect he is he might uh, he's only 16 as well um, 6 goals 3 assists maybe one more year on loan at a higher level of football and then I think he'll be in the he'll be first team ready Probably the biggest game of the season coming up now. <clears throat> A game that we should win, realistically, but you just don't know. Right, 
Duris in goal, Francis is right back, Coetzee and Diaz in centre defence, Bruce is left back, Petrovic spots in the midfield, Bowler on the right, Bar in the middle, Salio on the left, with up front. Let's go. Let's freaking go. <coughs> Uh, in fact, let's put the latest scores on so we can see what's going on. Uh, Hibs are playing Queen's Park. They're probably fresh and knowing Arnold. We need a miracle. We need to win and we need the down Celtic losing to Motherwell. Right, first highlight of the game goes to us. Good ball. Ah. Oiland's slacking lately. <clears throat> right, bowling now. Bar. Oh, come on, Bar. <clears throat> right, corner. Come on, let's get a goal. Let's get a goal. Come on. Oh, we're fourth. Why are we fourth? I think it's because Celtic's losing. <clears throat> so we don't necessarily have to win this game. We've just got to hope the Celtic lose. And we don't bloody lose. It would be a good idea. Oh, for God's sake, like clockwork. <coughs> Sorry about that. I should have warned you before I did that. Sorry. All right, so. Motherwell still winning. Keeps a draw in. Uh, this doesn't look like likely we're going to come back from this. I'm going to go um, yeah, attack in. <clears throat> Let's bring these further in, like so. Does make us more vulnerable defensively, but we've got to throw everything at the kitchen sink here. Rezo, is that the Rezo I'm thinking of? It is! Matthias Arezzo. I made him famous many, many FMs ago. I bought him from Rayo Vaticano and I, uh, nobody ever heard of him and I mentioned him on the Saigon forum. So I'll take full credit for his career. Same as uh, Tangoy Nundumbelli when he was at Lyon. I uh, I mentioned him and uh, I take full credit for him as well. So there you go. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. Uh, I did discover them, but I didn't. I didn't. I did uh, mention them, but they would have. They would have done well in real life as well, anyway. And I, I, I'm bound to be not the first person that actually discovered them. Come on, let's go, let's go. Oh, come on. Running out of time here. We need to get at least a, a, a draw it. No. No. Oh, come on, let's go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Right, Hoyland, you're coming off. You're just playing rubbish. You're just being rubbish. Stuart to the rescue. Uh, Bobson needs to come off. Uh... Right, free kick. Come on, fingers crossed. Ah, oh, unlucky. What's the latest score still? What? Well, Melbourne well, still winning. Gives a draw in. Come on, if we get a draw, we're in the top. We're in the. Champions League part of it. Celtic won't be in it, which will be weird. 
No, Dundee United's going to win this, and then they're going to score again in a second. All right, come on. Come on, we just need to get a draw. Uh, I think they're more likely to score than we are this right? That's it. That's us. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Ooh. Might be saved. Alright. Come on, can I do a team talk? Can I do a shout, please? Come on, we get a little lady. Oh, come on, Mulligan, sir. That's not what we need right now. Head out. No. <sighs> now it's over. Absolute bottlers, the lot of you. You should be ashamed of yourselves. Celtic was still losing. Hibs were drawing. We could have got top four. <sighs> Yeah, let's get a consolation goal now where it doesn't matter. Well done. Yeah, here we go. We'll get a goal here. Just to pee me off even more. See? We've got no time to get another goal. <sighs> yeah, just outside of the Champions player. So... Oh, hold on. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm an idiot. I thought it was all over. <laughs> I didn't think we'd even get into the Champions um, playoff situation. Oh, God, I feel like such an idiot right now, stressing about that. Right then, I'll be back for the next part of the episode where I'm a lot less stressed out. And we're back for the next part of the episode. Um, we've got the Scottish Cup semi-final next. Which is probably our closest chance to getting anything worthwhile this season. We've still got a chance of getting in the European European um, competitions. But, um, not if we carry on the way we're going. Right, nothing really worth mentioning in the inbox items. Hopefully we can beat St Mirren. Right, dearest in goal. Francis on the right, Cotes, Cote, uh, Coetzee and Diaz in centre defence, Bruce as left back, Petrovic in the middle of midfield with Bobson, Bowler on the right, Barr in the middle, Ruiz on the left and Hoyland up front. Nice to see Ruiz back. Hopefully he can make a, a big difference. in possession. Bar? 
Oh, lucky. On to us, Ruiz. Ruiz, I know. Oh. Bob's in, back to Ruiz, Ruiz. Oh. St. Miriam playing very well defensively here. Yeah. We're going to struggle, I think, to get anything past them. I think if we're going to win, it's probably going to be like by one goal. I think Boulder definitely needs to go in the summer. He's completely gone downhill recently. He's just not able to. He was a good player. I mean, let's have a look, actually. Oh, I say that. He's actually had a decent season. <laughs> I just feel like every time I watch him on here, though, lately, he's just performing badly, but maybe he'll prove me wrong in this game eventually. Three shots on target out of seven so far. So we've been a better team. We've just not been able to put our chances away, which I think is more to do with Hoyland more than anything else. No, I'm going to take... Triple substitution here. So, Salier on the left. Uh, not Bar. Bowler. Bowler can come off. We'll put Cruella on there. And then, oh God, Gellhart's my only option. I oh know, Ross Stewart will man about. All right, there we go. Right, let's see if the triple substitution will make a difference. Coella loses the ball. That's a terrible mistake. If we lose the... Oh, God, here we go. Come on, Coella. Right, all our substitutions have used up. We've got a corner. Come on. Oh, my God. We can't score to save our lives lately. What's going on? Extra time is ahead of us. Right. Let's play it out from the back. Ali Salir, Diaz, come on, don't cock up here. I feel like we're playing ourselves into danger here with this, this approach. Okay. There we go. Lujan, cross to Bobson. Bobson, forward. Oh, there we go. Oh, Ali Salir. Cool that Oh. Didn't lead to anything. Sixteen shots, six on target, one point five zero XG, but no goals as of yet. Let's try firing up the players. This is gonna to go to penalties, isn't it? Oh god, I don't think my my nerves can handle a penalty shoot out. Oh, great. Right. Muller for... Oh, God. Thomas Muller. They've got Thomas Muller. I keep forgetting about that. Oh, one. Come on, then. Pressure's on us. Pressure is on us. Ross Stewart. Come on. Yes. Thank God for that. All right. Boatista. Oh, nearly, nearly got a hand to that. Come on, Duras, you're good at penalty saving. You should be helping us here. Right, pressure on the young lad, Moran. Can he? He does. Thank God for that. Right. Ball's back in their court now. Mitchell lines up for St. Miriam. Come on. I'll do us. Come on. Oh, no. Here we go. Bar. Can he keep us in this? Come on, Bar. Come on. Yes. 
very, very, very close to him saving that, but we got it. Come on, Duras. Tejera. Oh, no. Here we go. Here we go. Bobson. He's going to miss this. Bobson. Oh, he doesn't. Well done, Bobson. You proved me wrong. Right, pressure's back on them now. Uh, Diane. Come on, Duerst. Be the hero. Be the hero. Yes, get in. Go on, Duerst. Right, come on. Let's score this. Come on, we can do this, lads. Who's taking this? Ali Salia. Taking up the penalty. He's lining up to take the penalty. Come on. Come on, Salia. Come on. Yes! Get in! Get in! Oh, thank God for that. I go for I'm gonna go for a Rizzo. Probably won't sign for us, but I'm still gonna go for him. Twelve million, Jesus Christ! Yeah, you are worrying me a bit, Hoyland. Hoyland and maybe, maybe Hoyland, maybe Boulder's going in the summer. I think. I think it's just time for a change. Probably get rid of. No, yeah, Rizzo won't come to us. I think we need to just completely change the whole not the whole team but a lot of the team we need to change especially in the forward positions i think because you look at it like this ross stewart 14 goals a season out of 14 games is great but he's not our main striker it's hoyland and hoyland's not performing if you look at how many goals where's the tactics come on if you look at hoyland seven goals for the season which is not good for a striker he got four goals last season so he definitely needs to be leaving. Oh God, we're playing Hibs in the final. Muller gets a considered major contender for award. Scottish players, young player of the year. Okay, fair enough. Let's see how Gary Ruiz doing. Gary Ruiz consistently playing for Juventus, which is good to see. Uh, his value could be up to 129 million. I really wish we had a future fee clause on that. Um, I think he's going to go on to become uh, Scotland international, probably get 100 caps from him, it's all said and done. Oh, he, he needs to go as well because he's always injured. Uh, Lowry probably needs to go because he's barely played. Could probably get some money for him. Celtic next game. Celtic's done well to get back in it. They were like fifth or sixth at one point. Um, they've leapfrogged past us, which is expected. <coughs> Sorry about that. It would be great if we could get Champions League football next year, but I, I don't think it's going to happen. But we're still on course to get the same. I can't. I think we finished fourth or third or something in one season, and uh, I'll have a look in a sec. Right, club info, history. So we finished. Third last season, and then the season before we finished sixth. So if we get like fourth or fifth, that's probably in the middle of the two. Uh, we can still technically get third place. We got fifty nine. They got they got six. Nah, we ain't gonna get third place. We gotta hope to get like oh no, Celtic. Sorry, I was looking at the wrong one then. Uh, we could technically get third place if we beat Celtic. We'll be back in here. Um, and then we've got how many fixtures we got after Celtic? We've got Hibs next game. So if we beat Celtic Hibs, which ain't gonna happen, but let's say in the perfect scenario we beat them. And then we've got four games, uh three games left in the league. 
after that. So you never know. But our form has been terrible lately. Can I do a team meeting? No, I can't. I think the pressure's on Celtic though, to be honest, not us. So you never know. Um I'm gonna put Stuart up front instead of Hoyland in this game because Hoyland's not playing well enough. Uh put Coella on for bowler. Rios can play instead of Bobson, give him a bit of game time, swap them two about. Oh, oh, Yano's back, so that's good. All right, let's see how we get on with this team. Ali Sanlia. No, I'll leave him in, actually. Right, let's see how we get on against Celtic. Hopefully, we get a good start. Corner to Celtic, just headed over. Oh god, I think it's going to be one of these games where Celtic's just all over us. Ah, oh, there we go. Nicely, nicely seen by Rios to intercept the pass. Do us back to Rios. Rios across to you, Ayano. Ayano flies past Turnbull but loses the ball in the end. Get the ball back. Ali Salia goes past Hume. Oh, God, terrible passing. We need a focus, lads, focus. All right, Coella sprints past their players. Look at that, that was a bit of tech as that was. You are my Coella. was a wonderful goal, great goal, great individual goal by him. Just going to praise the goal scorer and assist. So yeah, we're third place now. We're going to corner. If we get another goal here, we'll be alright, I think. I think we'll do well defensively not to concede to. Oh, look at that. That was a bit of, beautiful bit of techers by Ali Salia. Two nil. Spray them. See. Fourth now. So Hibs are winning probably, aren't they? Hibs are beating Rangers. R Rangers are top, I think. So if they turn it around, there you go. 1-1. One, one. That helps us greatly. Who's the other teams we've got to watch out for? Hearts losing. That's good. That works out good for us. So this could be a perfect result for us if we keep our lead in this game. Uh, Diaz is knackered though, we've got quite a few knackered players now. Come on Rangers. Lujan. Oh, here we go. Ross Stewart, maybe? Oh, he does. Get in. Three nil. Come on, Rangers. Do us a favour. Get the winner. Sound tip might get a consolation goal here. Hopefully they don't. They do. Let's hope that's not one of one of three. We do not want to draw this game now, and then we've done well. Oh no, that was my dog, by the way. It's okay, Baxter. It's okay. Right, great little victory there. Now we're up to third. Now we're cooking. We beat Hibs. 
We're getting closer to hearts. That's what I like to see. We've got to beat Hibs first, though. I'm not going to get too excited. Big, big game now. I think this is now the biggest game of the season. I said it was Dundee United a few games ago, but this one's bigger now. dodgy mic and I thought my dog just knocked the wire there so I, did, I thought you uh, I thought the mic stopped working that noise you can hear is the dog drinking water just in case you can't. I don't know how much noise you can hear in the background. Um, my mic is pretty good at stopping the noise, but just in case. Right, if my mic stopped working in a second, it's because the dog's knocked the cable, so... Yeah, sorry about that. As I predicted, the dog knocked the cable. It's very sensitive, the mic I've got. Um, I thought it was the USB lead to start off with, and I bought, I've had about three or four different USB leads, and it's just, I think this is the pins in the mic where it, the USB lead connects to. So the slightest movement at times can knock it off. I could literally just do this now, lift my laptop and move my leg, and it can go off like so. So yeah, so luckily, most of the time, I can see it when it goes off, so it's not too much of an issue. But, but there has been times where I've not realised and recorded an episode, and it's been, and then I've had to get rid of it and start the episode again. Right, you didn't miss anything. I I stopped um, doing what I was doing. Ah, oh, Diaz is out for two weeks. That's not what we need this time of the season. Mm, right, hips now. Hopefully the, the lads will be up for this because they beat Celtic. They're through to, I think the Scottish Cup final we're through to now. Can we? Let's have a look. Yeah, we're playing Hibs in, oh God, we're playing Hibs in the Scottish Cup final. Forgot about that. Right, let's hope we beat them in this game and then beat them in the Scottish Cup final. Two big games against Hibs now. One in the league, and then there'll be one in the cup later on. Right, let's see how we get on. So, Dewurst in goal. Yano is right back. Francis and Lujan in ten defence. Bruce on the left. Bobson and Petrovic in midfield. Bowl on the right. Barr in the middle. Ruiz on the left. And Hoyland up front. We're giving Hoyland another chance here. Hopefully he won't let us down. Right, first highlight goes to us, hopefully. Good little passing going on. Barter Ruiz. Bruce now. Back to Bobson, across to Ruiz. Get in, 1-0. Brendan Barr. Probably been our best player in the last three or four games, to be honest. Sorry, itchy head. So 
Now Yano crosses it in. Gibbs now in possession. Kenny sprints past us. Good. Get the ball back. Oh, we lose it though. There, one one. I knew that was gonna happen. Ah okay. Let's not try not to get too downhearted about it. Bowler. Headed out by them. We get the ball back though, Bob's in. I don't know why I can't do a shout, it's really annoying. Right. Oh, look at that beautiful little passing going on here. Oh, Ruiz. Right, come on, let's get, let's get us a chance. Go on then, Petrovic. Oh, he hits the bar. Unbelievable. Right, corner to us, Ruiz. Floats it in. Headers. Headed out by Hibbs. Can I do a shout yet? Why can't I do a shout? What's going on here? Ah, there we go. Right. Let's hope now this works out well for us. Come on. Bar. Can do no wrong. Look at that. That was an amazing error. We're watching that again. Watch it super slow motion. Uh, we'll change the camera angle. What should we do? TV. Try TV. There we go. Look at that. Douche. Unbelievable header. Two one, get in. Let's have a look at the results. Celtic are winning at the moment. Uh that's it. That's the only game we need to really pay attention to, I think, in this one. Other than our own. Oh, we got a penalty. Get in. Penalty. Ruiz. Lines it up. Yes. Get in. Excellent performance so far by Ruiz. One assist and one, one goal. Hibs will probably score another though, I reckon. Yeah. Okay, pressure's back on us again. <laughs> Doesn't last long, does it? Ugh. Would have been nice to keep that lead for a bit. Right, Boulder needs to come off in the second half, I think. So does Francis. In fact, oh, we can't do it. We can't give him a shout at the moment. Right. Uh, no, I'm just going to take them off. Uh, Suter. Stuart. Celtic winning 2 0 now. Let's have a look at the league table. So we're still third if we win this game. If we draw, I think Celtic leap progress. Go for that, come on. We are dicing with danger here. Focus. Great, great defensive play there by Barr. Barr is like a man possessed here. He does not want to lose this game. Fair play to him. Um, 
I don't know whether it's a shut shop here. Um, no, I'll leave it for another 10 minutes and see how we get on. Go on, Bar. Oh, yes, go on, get it. Get it, school, school. Oh, look at that. Brendan Bar. He is my new favourite player. He's took over uh, Ruby now as my new favourite player at the club. What a, what a goal. What a performance by him. Absolute amazing. In fact, you deserve a new contract, young man. I think you've already signed one recently, but you're going to get another one now. I'm willing to give you whatever you want. I'm not willing to let you go for that, though. We want at least 20 million, and we're going to put that in. Okay. You stay on the contract that you're on at the moment. How long have we got you for? We've got you for two more years. So, plenty of time to get you to agree. We might have to give you a big wage, though, to keep you here on a big minimum fee release clause. Um, but, yeah. Still third. Only three points behind Hibs. I mean, mathematically, I know it's not going to happen. Mathematically, we still could technically win the title, but we won't. But I'm just saying, we are doing well. All right. Um, let's see how many games we've got there. Yeah, so I'm going to call it an end to this episode. Um, and then... What we'll do is we'll come back tomorrow with the, the last part of the season. So, yeah. So, thank you as always. Hope you have a nice rest of your day. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.